uh, about Bowman Field. Before World War I, it was a big open farmland, and I think they were growing hemp. But it was owned by a German who was an officer in the German army. His name was Baron von Zedwitz, and he was an officer in the German army. And when the United States got in World War I, and Germany was on the other side, the U.S. government confiscated it. And it's been an American place ever since. But they tried to dodge it, the takeover of it, by putting it in von Zedwitz's wife's name, but that didn't work. So then the U.S. Army built some hangars here, and before World War I started, they were training bomber pilots for twin engine bombers here. And then during the war, they opened up the only uh, aerial evacuation nurse training here on this field. Then they trained glider pilots here. They trained liaison pilots here and quite a few other people. But that's more or less the history of it. I don't know any names involved other than the land was owned by Baron von Zedwitz and his wife Great. prior to World War I. So you, it became a um, more important than after World War I, World War II. Um, you were in the Civil Air Patrol and you used yes. to meet here, right? Yes. We used to meet in this, that building right up there. It's a hangar but it has offices on the air side of it. Okay. And, uh, and so what was the use for Bowman during World War II? All of those things I mentioned. They, oh, they, the evac, the nurses, the hospital, yeah. training center, yeah. and well, the glider pilot. At the beginning of the World War II, they trained twin engine bomber crews here. Gotcha. But they were needed so badly in the war that they <laughs> took them out pretty quickly. So what year was the administration building built? 1925, I believe. It's an, it's an Art Deco design, which was big back in the 20s. Sure, sure, okay. And they still have offices in that building. Neat. And so this was uh, Louisville's only airport until Standard Fruit Field was built. When was that? When did so commercial air, air traffic used to fly out of here as well. Yes. Mostly DC-3s, which were the war C-47s, yes. right? Yes, American Airlines, Eastern Airlines, and my family and others used to come out here and sit around on the benches near the administration building because right before the Derby, Hollywood stars were flying in for the Derby and Okay, that's this is the only way to get to Louisville, unless you came by a train. So when was Standard open? Was that in the late 50s or the early 50s? It was, it was open in, during World War II. Okay. Because B-29s used to fly into Standard to have their armament put on board, guns and other things, so that they could go from here to California to the Pacific to come join the, the uh, tw I think the 20th Air Force, they called it, where the B-29s were. Okay. And they flew out of, after the Marines captured several islands, they used to fly to Japan from Saipan and Guam in the Marianas Islands. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Thank you. All right.